What do you think we have to do as an industry as a whole to make sure that advertisers gain back their trust? I think that market quality is an incredibly important issue for both sides, frankly, of the mobile marketplace, both the advertisers and the publishers. Because when you're putting your brand, whether that's your brand as an advertiser or frankly your, your brand as a publisher um, out there, you know, that's your baby. And you, so you want to make sure that you're protecting it, you're putting it into a safe environment. Um, and on top of that, that you're really getting what is claimed that you're getting, like the eyeballs that you're getting, that real people are seeing your ads, that your ads are viewable. So we think that market quality is an incredibly important issue. Um, we try to make sure that market quality happens from the inception, from day one. So 25% of, uh, of all publishers, I'm sorry, are blocked on the Smato platform from the beginning in the initial screening. And cumulatively, there's a number of other measures that we take further on, but cumulatively over the course of the Smato platform, we've blocked 14% of all publishers like ever. So we try to make sure that screening measures are in place, fairly rigorous ones to begin with, so that there's not any traffic that has issues from the onset. In addition, on our end, we've got like teams, human teams, as well as technology that monitors constantly. Um, and on our uh, platform, uh, we're confident uh, that, um, that we don't have more than 2% fraud. And that's really important, um, I think, both for an advertiser and for publishers too, frankly, because they don't want to be in a neighborhood with other publishers that aren't, are a little shady. Um, and on top of that, they also want to make sure from an advertiser standpoint that the types of ads that are being run on their, um, on, in their apps are the types of ads that their uh, users are going to want to see. For example, let's say that you're talking Tom, a game for kids. You, there's really certain types of advertisement you don't really want kids on your in your app to see. So market quality is an issue on both sides, both for advertisers and for publishers, and is incredibly important to us and to the health of our industry. Um, so that as advertising transitions from television, a very kind of regulated, not so much regulated, but monitored uh, type of medium over to, to mobile and specifically more and more to in-app, that advertisers can be confident that they're getting quality messaging, quality eyeballs, and that consumers are actually seeing their messaging um, and giving them, at the end of the day, the trial and conversion that they're looking for. And as Smato, you've just released um, um, a white paper on the state of the current mobile advertising uh, world. So what is the biggest takeaway? Uh, so two things, not surprisingly, in-app, um, digital advertising will probably become a term of the past in fairly short order um, as, as mobile takes over and on top of that within mobile as in-app eats mobile web within mobile. Um, but on top of that, the big thing we're seeing is the rise of video uh, advertising, both from an ad spending point of view, like more and more ad spending moving over into the video format, which consumers see as very engaging. And on top of that, as we see, EP, eCPMs are just skyrocketing um, on, the, on the video side, like in terms of video ad formats. Uh, so we're definitely seeing that. And then we're also seeing huge growth. Um, and frankly, it's going on globally. So both in the mature markets, the biggest ones in each region being the US, China, um, and the UK, uh, we're seeing very healthy growth in the mature markets. And then, we're, not surprisingly, we're seeing just astounding growth in the emerging markets. Um, so overall, I would say it's a great time to be in mobile, um, a great time to be in mobile advertising, and a great time for brands to take advantage of mobile because it's really a medium that's able to do things that no technology, be it radio, TV, um, even the PC, you know, uh, could do before. So it's an exciting time for mobile.